our faith grows exceedingly sons and daughters of god november 21st joyful joyful we adore thee god of glory lord of love hearts and forth like lost before thee hail thee as the sun above Melt the clouds of sin and sadness, drive the dark of doubt away. Giver of immortal gladness, fill us with the light of day. We are bound to thank God always for you, brethren, as it is meet because that your faith groweth exceedingly. 2 Thessalonians chapter 1 verse 3 It is positively necessary for those who believe the truth to be making continual advancement, growing up into the full stature of men and women in Christ Jesus. There is no time for backsliding and indifference. Each one must have a living experience in the things of God. Have root in yourselves. Become grounded in the faith, so that having done all, you may stand with unwavering confidence in God through the time that will try every man's work and character. Exercise your powers in spiritual things till you can appreciate the deep things of God's word and go on from strength to strength. There are thousands who claim to have the light of truth who take no steps in advance. They have no living experience, notwithstanding they have had every advantage. The Word of God offers spiritual liberty and enlightenment to those who seek for it honestly. Those who accept the promises of God and act on them with living faith will have the light of heaven in their lives. They will drink of the fountain of life and lead others to the waters that have refreshed their own souls. The fruits of doubt are not desirable. Oh, look around you and see what havoc has been wrought by the evil one. Era and falsehood and heresy have held high carnival in the deceived hearts of men. From century to century, the adversary has repeated his experiments with growing success, for in spite of the sad records of lives that have gone out in the darkness, as moths fly to the fire, so men rush on into the ruinous deceptions that he has prepared to entrap them. Heaven and earth shall pass away, but the word of the Lord endureth forever, and unwavering faith in his word is the only faith that will endure through the perils of the last days. Ellen G. White Daily Devotions Within Hope of Eternal Life Ministry